This platform is a remarkable solution. And this is invented by the same group in Zinnerville and, and creating PEG, and they've created this new iteration called POTS. So you're seeing great group, very accomplished. Not only was it Steve Ledger, who I have great confidence in, has done just a great job as CEO since he came in. What attracted me to Serena is this posulated small molecule opportunity that has an extraordinary opportunity to create better products from molecules that already exist as drug products. We added Simba Gill. Simba was the entrepreneur in residence at like major groups, Texas Pacific and flagship. These are huge funds and they picked this guy as their entrepreneur in residence. I decided at a very young age actually to spend my life focused on science and what science could do to improve healthcare. And I'm very proud to have been involved in the biotech industry over the last three decades, which has had enormous positive impact on healthcare. And when he joined, okay, now we're beginning to build a team. And for me, get the drugs, five to seven drugs. If you do a great job, you're gonna be able to get great people. If you get great people and you have the drugs, you're gonna be able to raise finance. So we're beginning to tick the boxes. Then they had a Brad Curhan, the CFO, incredibly sophisticated as well. The whole thing with entrepreneurs is they always have to believe that they can do something even though the rest of the world has either already tried and yes. failed or hasn't thought about it, yes. there's something inside of them that says, well, I can do it. And then they just added Jay and Steven and Karen. Jay and Steven have just had exits in the multi-billions with their past projects, and they've joined. So you're beginning to see the momentum of quality people being attracted to this. And then our very own Richard Marshall in June S who wanted to receive a CBE from the Queen of England for his ability to do drug development. It's up to the biotechnology and pharma companies to invest in technologies that will make sure drug development is faster and more effective, so cheaper, more efficient. We have a pretty rock star board of directors and team surrounding this technology, and that's the key to success.